Ukrainians face new hurdle at U.S. border, no dogs. There, they joined hundreds of Ukrainians waiting their turn to cross the border. In no time, Eddie was bounding gleefully across the mats that lined a large gym that had been transformed into a massive dormitory for refugees. We felt confident, trusting everything was fine, Ira recalled. Then, all of a sudden, we heard you can't cross with your dog. After their trip of more than 6,000 miles across four international borders, this barrier seemed the most formidable. They considered reversing their steps. To stay up to date with latest top stories, make sure to subscribe to this YouTube channel by clicking the button above this video. Ms. Pindrick, the American volunteer working with the refugees in Tijuana, said the process for gaining legal access to the United States under current procedures, which include a permit and possible quarantine, could take weeks. For many of these families that have been through trauma, it is important to keep their family together, including their pets, that they spent so much energy, money and care to bring with them, she said. We understand the requirements the U.S. has in place and reasons for them, but it is impossible for the refugees to satisfy them. The CDC said it had issued a number of permits for people arriving from Ukraine with their pets. We are working with NGOs in Mexico and the U.S along the border to ensure persons arriving from Ukraine with their dogs meet entry requirements before entering the U.S. or that they have a safe place to quarantine dogs if they arrive and do not meet CDC. Entry requirements, the agency said.